guys so welcome and welcome back again to my channel as you can see i'm seated yes and i love smiling a lot if you haven't noticed ah that's my hobby i love smiling and laughing anyway so in today's video i thought about, i was thinking i have been thinking about doing this video but then uh you don't know your girl is too lazy for life so Today we are going to be talking about something called Upwork. I have mentioned it in uh, one of my videos. Yeah, uh, which video? Should I say this one or this one? We are going to say it. I'm going to highlight it on my description and also up here. You're going to get it like a suggested video. So today I just thought about explaining how Upwork definitely works. So I hope you're going to enjoy this video. Those who are new are Maluki and welcome 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 to my family and welcome to my channel if you haven't subscribed kindly do that or else i'll come into your dreams and you won't like it <laughs> anyway that's a long intro so we're going to start i'm going to give you like everything okay i've been using upwork for the past one year i joined upwork last year and uh, it has done me like great like very good because for me, I love writing or I love telling stories and uh, yeah, it has helped me. Just know in short, it has helped me and I wouldn't want people not to get cash. Eh? Speaking English, and it's a marketplace for freelancers in fields like writing, graphic designing and web development. Basically, that is what Upwork does. If you are a web developer, if you are a web designer, you love anything, just designing and uh, websites, all that, and writing, everything. So for me, I'm a short storyteller. <laughs> I cannot tell you, I cannot, I cannot narrate for you stories, but I can write it down for you. So I'm a short storyteller, a novella, and a novel uh, writer. If you do want me to write for you a novel or a short story, just. Uh, DM me. I will leave my Instagram up. <laughs> so, it's a marketplace for freelancers in the fields of writing, graphic designing, and web development. And uh, this site helps professionals find projects, communicate with clients, and also get paid. Yani, get paid. Actually, this time round, I am very broke. Trust me, I only have 50 Kenyan shillings. This is how 50 Kenyan shillings look like. The new currency. This is how it looks like, like 50 bob. Sijali, I'll get rich soon. So, if you're a new freelancer or working in the new field, you can rank up valuable experience without always having a, having to pitch a, cli a client's quote. Like, to be sincere, it's really hard to get your first job on APAC, but I will show you how to do that so that you can get accepted to the site for you to start working as a freelancer so in upwork there is freedom to work on ideal projects on upwork you run your own business and choose your own clients and projects what i'm basically meaning i will uh, be showing you somewhere either it's on the on the two sides either here or here how what i mean by it's an ideal okay you just choose whatever you want to do there so just complete your profile and we'll highlight ideal jobs and also such projects and response to clients invitations what this means is you write us a proposal like there was a job that was submitted by let's say a client and you want to work for that person so whatever you're going to do is you're going to write a proposal the client is going to read your proposal if he or she wants to employ you then they're going to hire you anyway that is for another so there is a wide variety and a high pay for real that is true you can write for me as a short storyteller i work hourly so per hour you have to pay me between 20 to 25 dollars that's in kenya 2000 shillings and that's a lot of money that is per hour and if i work for you per hour i have per day i have to work like three hours to four hours so like in a day you can make 80 dollars and above that is 8000 kenyan shillings so more and more success yeah the greater the success you have on projects the more likely you are 
to get hired by clients they always do this thing called ranking if you are a raising talent if you have a raising talent like you've been doing work and uh, the clients have been liking your work you're going to get like a raising the site or the upwork is going to identify you as a raising talented person and if you have uh, been doing like the jobs well they're going to rank you as uh, I cannot remember but I'll show you <laughs> how do I get hired by clients so it all starts by creating a great profile I'll show you my profile and submitting a compelling job proposal for a job proposal I don't know how I'm going to show you that but for you to do um, to get hired this is what you do getting work online is a lot like traditional searching you submit applications on projects then impress potential clients before being offered the project this is what we call okay we are going to be given connects connects are like bidding things that are supposed to use so that for you okay for you to get hired you need this certain amount of connects like for me I always go for four to six connects you can also buy the connects of which they go to at around three dollars for 20 connects yeah I'll check I'll check for you how much they go so uh, why you have to create an outstanding profile to showcase your business as in you're an entrepreneur you're a freelancer so you have to showcase whatever you have so think of it as an introduction a resume and uh, a marketing brochure rolled into one highlighting your professional skills experience and portfolio a portfolio is something like what past jobs have you done what have the other clients said about you but you being as a newbie to this site can be really hard because you don't have anyone who has actually certified that you are a good client or you're a good freelancer or anything like that but then that that shouldn't be an issue for you so you show your education and accomplishment accomplishments hey god english is trouble it came by the plane <laughs> so an online skill test results the best profiles are complete well written error free and feature a professional friend looking picture so do not take a picture like you are in the bedroom like you, you've just sat there so whatever this profile picture is supposed to portray it's supposed to portray that you are a potential client uh, you're a potential potential hey god yes so let us continue i had gone somewhere i had gone out so sending the client a compelling proposal eh? this will greatly let us just go back to wherever we were Oh yeah, I was I was talking about the profile picture. A profile picture needs to be somewhere clear, somewhere that is blank, like let's say a white background or a black background. So you just choose a perfect thing. But you see, the thing that is behind me that is not supposed to be there. So when you're creating a profile picture, make it look as professional as possible. You can actually it's just look for a photographer or have your best friend like create a frame for you at the back anyway that's a lot of talking about the photo the foot at the photograph the picture so sending the client a compelling proposal this way uh, this will actually greatly increase your likelihood of getting an interview okay that is submitting the proposal getting an interview then getting hired so those are steps that are supposed to actually consider when you're looking for this work so uh make sure your proposal proposal is when you've decided i want to do this job you've seen a job that has been posted so you click on it you go submit a proposal according to the connects that you have so if you want so bad to, to do that to work then write a professional well written and error free proposal tailor made for your work you're seeking and a true presentation of your strengths and skills don't say that you don't okay don't go apply for a work you're a web designer but then you go applying for a work that belongs to someone who writes novel and if you are a graphic designer then you go applying for work like a videography or a videographer something like that and your profile doesn't say that then your chances of getting that job are going to be low 
So with Upwork, you have the freedom and flexibility to control when, where, and how you work. Each project includes an online workspace shared by you and your clients, according, allowing you to, okay, yeah, allowing you to work. I don't know what I was writing there. So how does Upwork's platform help me manage my work? Upwork provides a user-friendly platform to help you chat and share files, track your time, and get paid. So for hourly projects, this is how it works for hourly projects. For me, I love hourly projects because they pay a lot and uh, they are efficient. I don't like fixed prices because they you have to go with the escrow protection, all that. It's a lot, a lot of work. So you okay for you. Upwork is a site or an app. You can download it. You can have it on your laptop. You can have it on your phone. I have it on my phone. So download the Upwork desktop app. It includes the work diary, which helps ensure you're paid for the work you do by taking work in progress screenshots. Every 10 minutes during a billable time, it provides proof to your clients that you are hard at work on their projects. You can also manually track hours in the app if your clients agrees. Okay, so that is how our hourly projects will work. Okay, the, for fixed projects, set milestones and deadlines with your client for each part of the project. Like let's say if you're doing a business plan project, you can now have, I can see the lighting is going and I always use the natural lighting. So, <laughs> sorry about that. You for, okay, like let's say you're writing something like a business plan. You can decide on the introduction, the preference, and uh, that part you're going to charge that as, like, let's say $10 or $20. It's according to you. Whatever you want to charge, then charge it. Then submit work for each milestone. Your client will release funds from escrow upon approval. So that is why I was saying I don't like fixed prices. So all projects include Upwork payment protection. So that is protection. You're going to get paid for your work that you're doing. So it helps ensure that you get paid for all work successfully completed through Upwork. Okay, so you have to do work and complete it. How will I get paid by my clients? That is a question that people always ask. All payments are made securely through our lines. They are licensed escrow service. Sorry for saying our. It's not mine. It's theirs. So receive funds via whatever payment method works best for you. So for me, I always get my payments through PayPal, the ATM, and uh, M-Pesa. M-Pesa is for Kenya, for those who have Safaricom line. So there is direct deposit or ACH. There is PayPal. There is wire transfer. There is local funds transfer. That is LFT. And uh, Payona. I don't know what Payona is. When working on hourly projects, you are eligible for Upwork payment protection that helps assure that an hour worked is an hour paid, okay? So if you work for one hour, then you're going to get paid for that one hour. If you work for one and a half hours, you're going to be paid one, the, whatever, if it's $20, $20 plus, plus the $10 for that a half an hour. On fixed price contracts, Refined milestones payments from uh, your clients are secure with Upwork fixed price protection. Okay, so definitely you're going to get paid. That's why I love Upwork. And guys, that's basically it for Upwork. If there is anything you haven't understood, let me know in the comments below. I will be answering each and every single one of you. Okay. So thank you very much for watching this video. I hope it helps you in future. It's a good freelancing site. It's a good place for you to work if you don't like the pyramid stuffs. But for me, I love everything that brings money in my, po in, in my pockets. So thank you very much for watching. And I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was educative enough for you to understand how Upwork works. So yeah. Bye. I love you guys. If you haven't subscribed yet to my channel, kindly do that or else i'll come into your dreams and you won't like it anyway bye love you guys